Hey guys, I'm Pixel Dan, and this is a review of the Mega Man Fully Charged Deluxe Drill Schematics Mega Man. That's right, this is our first figure in the line of Mega Man himself where he has stolen the powers from one of the Robot Masters. This is one of the deluxe figures in the lineup, so the packaging is slightly bigger, and we get a little action feature with the figure inside, which is pretty cool stuff. So why don't we go ahead and just get him opened up and get a closer look at him. So if we bring in the tape measure here, you can see the figure stands right at about four and a half inches tall, which puts him on par with the standard Mega Man action figure. But of course, the thing that really makes him stand out is that the colors on this one and the design is different because when he steals a Robot Master's powers, it's not just the arm cannon that changes, his whole outfit changes. So this kind of really shows that. So, you know, I've got Mega Man here with the drill arm that we took off the Drill Man figure, just to show you the difference. But this one right here, he's decoed out a little bit different. We even got some extra sculpting, like the ridges we can see in the torso there. And of course, he's that bright orange, black, and silver coloring. So he really stands out as something different. Now the overall articulation is the same as the standard Mega Man figure there. So ball joint at the head, the arms are ball jointed as well. You do have a bend in the elbow on the right and the right wrist swivels. There is no bend over on the left elbow, but that's because he's got this much bigger cannon that I'm gonna show you here in just a bit. He does still have the ball like hinges there at the thighs, so legs can go forwards, backwards, and outwards. And then he's got standard joints at the knees, no extra articulation there in the boots. So it's pretty much the same as what we saw with the standard figure. Of course, the big difference here is that he's got a little action feature on his new drill cannon. By turning this little wheel here, it spins the drill. And look at that, it works really, really well. So that is a cool feature. Again, it's just different than what we saw with the other release. So this is just the little drill arm that uh, came with Drill Man that I attached to our basic Mega Man figure. So you can see the difference there. It's slightly bigger because of the action feature, but also it's painted a little bit better. We got the extra green paint and everything on there. So that is pretty cool stuff and it does work really well. Of course, it's not removable on this figure, but really fun action feature nonetheless. So he comes with one little extra thing in the form of this little rock. And as you can see, it's meant to be broken apart. So the whole idea here is that you would use this drill, just like that, and it just breaks it up into all these little pieces here. That's all it is. So just a fun little pack in. Um, you gotta find the way it kind of fits back together. It's almost like a little puzzle, but like it kind of clips back together, just like that, just like that. And then this piece here, it doesn't really lock in. It's really loose. You almost basically have to hold it together. So that's why you would just basically set it on the ground and then Mega Man drills it up. So that way it allows him to use his drill abilities. And that's pretty much it. That's all there is to it, but he's a really fun figure. I think he's really solid, and uh, I do think it's fun getting the, the different colors of Mega Man after he has stolen the various Robot Master powers, or the Drill Man schematics, as they call it in the fully charged cartoon series. So I gotta give a very special thanks to the folks at Jack's Pacific for sending this figure along, allowing me to open it up and get a good look at it here on video. These are hitting store shelves right now. I found it at places like Target already. So happy hunting, my friends. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, hit that like button, leave me a comment to let me know what you think, and don't forget to subscribe. Until next time, my friends.